going on guys uh guess what guess who caved first guess who caved first that's right tiffany that's really tiffany Thank you for your having faith in myself. Okay. I can't believe that it has come to this. I cannot believe that it really is just Charlottesville all over again. Because in Charlottesville, all over again, was dealing with that other Korean bitch. So, <laughs> Tiffany just got sting opt for the past week. Now, Tiffany annoyed me so very much that I decided to push her buttons right back. Now, uh... I think that this was justified in me doing this because she asked for it. For some odd reason, for the past, I don't even want to know how long, that Tiffany has been stalking me on Twitter and regular dating apps. Apparently, she has also been stalking me on, we'll just say, dating apps I do not use. Okay? Now, I will say... When I say things, like I used to be involved in sting operations and, and not really by choice. And then after a while, I was so good at it, they decided to pay me to do it. And all that bullshit. What I'm pretty much trying to say is this isn't my first rodeo. Okay? Let me give you some examples. There was that douchebag. Uh, oh, fuck, what was his name? Bake something, bake something or other. Uh, bake something from Alaska. He annoyed me one too many times. So what I did is this was. What the fuck is she talking about now? Like, she thinks she's like trying to save me now. So like I have to explain to her what's going on. You see, like it's kind of cute because it means I literally could do it. Look. I also at the same time, I don't think she's doing this because like she is concerned. I think she's doing it to try to save face. And let me explain what's going on. Uh you are beautiful. You are beautiful. The most beautiful creature. Woman. On the planet. Don't ever change. Let's bone smoke up her ass now. Okay. So. I have known... About her, look. So that stupid loser baked Alaska. He annoyed me. I remember specifically he was trying to uh, say, you're not part of the movement, blah, 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 blah. And I was like, what the fuck movement are you talking about, you stupid Masonic puppet? You fucking sellout piece of shit who was owned by and operated by all these fucking puppeteers of the banks and all that bullshit so since he wouldn't annoy me and again like <sighs> human trafficking is just one of those really gray areas because some of the things that are done to catch the traffickers are I don't want to say illegal but it's like they you get permission to bend or break laws and certain things like that 
because you have to catch people. It's a sting op, right? So, uh, this was back at the, during the time of, um, of, um, of, uh, when we were doing op ices and shit like that too. So I was doing, uh, uh, Merc shit, but on my own. You don't want to use your own picture because then people will know you're, you're, you're doing shit or worse, see you in real life, right? It's embarrassing. So I used allegedly Baked Alaska's picture and purposefully was doing things to bring heat on him just to annoy and fuck with him in real life. It got to the point where I had, uh, using his picture allegedly, had matched and seduced some fucking crazy uh, 50-year-old trans lady who worked for CNN up in Pennsylvania and had convinced her that no matter what I say on Instagram, I really, really, really want to talk to you and that's just my managers and you should ignore them and you should keep on going. And as I understand, that bitch flooded his account and annoyed him, basically stalked him and shit like that. Like, that's just one of the things, allegedly, that you could do uh, to fuck with someone in a sting up, right? God, she's doesn't the same very fuck. Then she's going to the same fucking retarded fucking thing again. My man, go to Tiffany. You know what I do. Anyways, I, I've, and uh, another thing is, I probably shouldn't say this, but like, every now and then, when I have to, like, again, like, I shouldn't say it, but like, oh man, there's, everything's getting shut down now, so there's really, no, even like, they're like, I haven't had a need to do some shit like this in years at this point in time, okay? Um, when I say shit like, I know that Blair White's obsessed with me, because I know that Blair White makes accounts trying to like match up with me on apps I don't use uh, but that have been used before in part of sting operations because I keep telling people even tinder is full of feds I guarantee you that bitch on tinder who who's a hooker trying to get me to pay her six hundred dollars for sex probably she was a cop or someone working with the cops and six hundred dollars is a threshold for being charged with a higher crime probably what it was because they all do that and they all have quotas okay that's why i've been saying for years don't use these apps that's why for years when tiffany's been trying to match with me on tinder and all that bullshit i've been suspicious as fuck because i don't know who the fuck she is in real life okay maybe i'm that old school and the world has changed that much but like that's just the way it is i'm used to it okay still okay i don't trust people on apps i don't use apps there's no need for apps anyways so since Tiffany has been annoying me so much and kept on prioritizing all these loser-ass grifters. I decided to go ahead. Now think about it. Think about it. This is just going to be straight up. Straight up honest, okay? Like, I haven't gone anywhere and I haven't done anything all week. Except for that one time when I did warn that bitch about the mushrooms. But there's a specific reason why I, we, we didn't fool around or have sex. Because I was just honestly, I was like, holy shit. Uh, someone in actual need. And again, like, I'm not trying to make a whole thing out of it. But like, Jesus went amongst, you know, the prostitutes and, and the downtrodden and whatnot. So like, you can kill two birds with one stone, right? But like... The point I'm saying is that that's just not what I do. That's just not who I am. And I don't really have a need to justify it to anyone, right? However, 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 she's going to ask me to like talk to Telegram and whatnot. I, I, I'll just beat her to the punch. This is a great conversation. I don't use dating apps often. Would you care 
to talk more on Telegram or WhatsApp. <sighs> now, also at the same time, like one of the ways that I was telling you that like back in Seville, which is when I started doing uh, uh, human trafficking, sting ops, I guess you can call it Merc work, because uh, the other Korean girl got me involved in that bullshit because uh, she was a sugar baby and I didn't realize it. Um, uh, it's true, you, you can verify it. And I'm pretty sure Blair White has verified it. That's one of the reasons why she's so obsessed with me that I've known and my personal relationships with them is no one's business. But I've known a lot of the now very famous, we'll call them exotic porn stars, before they became famous. Um, some of like the biggest names that you probably like, probably like ones that you know, as like won all these awards before they won the awards, and they were like just like working in restaurants and like essing on dudes' deeds who who would give them rides home. They would like come to my apartment, they would come to my house and like crash on my couch, and like and like whenever a girl would break my heart, they would be the ones who were like, Do you want to fuck my throat for an hour? Allegedly, and all that, bullshit. like so they've verified that i don't i don't want to go into it right but you can say what you want to say about it. they're fucking hot and gorgeous as shit right they're gorgeous as shit and they're ready now all right How about line or signal? I didn't hack your telegram, by the way, okay? Anyways, so Blair White has been on record, and I hate that I have to talk about this dumb bitch, but Blair White has been on a record saying that her biggest fear is that someone she's dating would leave her for a biological woman. Okay? So, based on that assumption, it would make sense then that a biological woman's biggest fear would have someone leave them for Blair White. Okay? So, I kept telling her to stop pushing my buttons I kept telling her if she wants to play games we can play games I kept telling her I know what you're doing stop how long have I been saying that how long have I been saying I know what you're doing stop okay so I gave her exactly what she wanted okay so I used one of those apps I don't thank you moon goddess thank you moon goddess I'm so glad that you have graced me with your presence again I'm more than happy uh no I'm not a fake account she's a fake account she's me a fake account Anyways, so I was like, I'll just give her what the fuck she wants, because if she's good, like, I, I cannot stand those grifter ass losers, I cannot stand them, alright? On top of that, on top of that, 
Um, what was I saying? I lost train of thought. Keep telling her I don't like giving out pictures. It's a security risk. I don't like giving, especially shirtless pictures. And she wanted to see my, my, my D, which is fine. Come see it. I don't want to send that over the internet and shit like that, right? So, she finally convinces me to send her a shirtless pic. And then, she gets it, probably flicked her bean and some shit like that, and then had her, all her friends like, oh, great, they're getting along great. Now we can grift off of him. So I got pissed off. And I just gave her what she wanted. So since for the past four months, she's been expecting me to use these apps I do not use. Look, this is so stupid. Like, if... I'm not judging anyone or kink shaming or anything like that. If that's what you want to go after, that's those aren't the apps you use to get it. You're not going to do, do it that way. And I hate to say it to you, but any of the attractive ones are going to want some kind of monetary thing, not even payment up front, but you're going to have to have like a nice car or like a good apartment. They're going to they're going to want to get off the streets is what it is. All right, they're not doing that. So you can like hold their hand and tell them how pretty they are. They're doing that because they're trying to get a better life. So if you, if that's what you're after, you're gonna need to you know monetarily be able to provide for them. Is all I'm saying. Okay. So since she wouldn't leave me alone about the pictures and whatnot, and she wants to keep on trying to associate me with all these fucking grifters, I gave her what she wanted. I spammed my picture over all of those fucking apps that I've never. That I just don't like why the fuck look if I use them I would just be like I use them this is what I do you can't stop me blah 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 blah. again I'm not saying that I'm against any of that shit I'm saying if that's what you're into that's not the way to go about getting it but it's like whoever the fuck she was dating before has fucked her over so hard that she is just so traumatized and guess what guess what I guarantee you that uh, she saw those pictures on those apps because for the past whole week, she's been freaking out. Her and her fucking witch's coven have been like make, making articles about like, well, don't, don't do something you'd regret. Don't, don't do something over the breakup. It's not over yet. You two need to go counseling and work it out. And now that I'm talking to her again, they're like, now you should think about repentance and vindication. And now's the time to go back to virtues and morals. I didn't do anything, you stupid hags. I caught you fucking stalking me again. Again stalking me on some stupid shit. I wasn't even doing anything and you were stalking me on it. Okay? You didn't even admit to stalking me on it until I made you catch me on it. And to make sure you caught me, I gave the exact same pictures that you like so much. The pictures you begged me to give you, I gave to everyone else. That's what you wanted, right? Go tweet some more grifter ass bullshit. I might just go ahead and fuck Blair White. I might just. And then everyone else, like, I'm not trying to bring Blair White. I, I, I probably never would because she's a retarded grifter. But you know what I mean. A couple of her friends have matched with me on Tinder before and like basically were like trying to get my D. And I was like, I appreciate it. I thought you were a biological girl. I'm not against because you're really hot and whatnot. But like it would be like me slamming it and then you going away. It wouldn't be like dating and shit like that. But, you know, no one really should. No one should put up with that, I'm saying. But, like, I might, like, if you want to keep on pissing me off, I just might go do that. And then everyone will know, and everyone will know that Tiffany Wang's boyfriend went and started banging Blair White because she annoyed him. You want to play this game? Because that's what they've been, they were in damage control. Because they've been stalking me so very much. And they were probably like, he passed all of our tests. He isn't using any of the creepy apps all the other guys have been using. And then she kept tweeting grifters, so I started spamming everything on there. And now she's like, ooh, I can't, no one can find out about this. It'll make me look bad. And all that, but you know what's making you look bad? Not talking to me like a normal person. I keep telling you, I know what you're doing and you ignore it and you do it anyways. Do you want to keep playing this game? We can keep playing this game. Okay, I don't care about social hierarchies. Okay, look, 
part of the, the first time they brought me in to an undercover police station to do a sting op. Look, it was I'm not gonna say the name of it, but it was it was a nail salon. You go into the nail salon, okay? They scan some card. The fucking nail salon wall came up. You go in past that into a bunker. It's all these cops with badges and like sonar gear and Uzis and shit like that. And it's fucking nuts, okay? Oh my god, I remember the first time I was I was like, they know everything. They're listening on everything. Everything's a setup. It's, oh my god. But anyway, look, so like, I've been doing this shit for a minute. Why, why, why did I bring that up? I brought that up for a second with the Uzis and all that shit. I don't remember right now. I started doing that shit before I got before I got this. I got this shit doing that shit, but um, a whole different ball game. But look, I'm telling you, can you please just be normal? But yeah, but anyways, so they brought me into that shit, right? And the first thing they told you, the first thing they told me is they were like, "You gotta understand something. No one's gonna know the real you." everyone's gonna think you're a gigantic piece of shit and I was like uh okay well I won't think that and they're like good you're gonna have to hold on to that and then we started doing the sting ops so like I don't particularly care what society I'm used to it by now okay this bitch cares nothing else about what society thinks of her okay okay I highly recommend you rethink the way you view society okay or at the very least can you please stop pushing my buttons i didn't do anything i didn't do i don't have to do anything all right i why the fuck would i do that all i want to do is get my cloud certification and pa get my other certification and try to patch up things with the people that i that i didn't realize i was screwing over because tiffany was feeding me lies okay and if she wants to show up and do shit for real, I'm all for that. I've been saying that for four months. But can you please stop assuming that I'm whatever the fuck these other people were to you that damaged you, okay? It's annoying as fuck. You're so just like, oh, everything you're doing doesn't make sense. Like, Anyways, so that's what's been going on this entire week. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. And like, look, everyone knows Blair White's obsessed with me. Everyone knows it. Tiffany, if you keep it up, I might just fuck Blair White. All right? Come on now. Be normal. Be normal. All right? Do you want to do this? Yes or no? Be normal. Okay? Or do you want to be the, the, the girl who couldn't keep a dude because she, Blair White? Do you want to do that? Do you want to play games? We'll play games. All right, everyone have a nice day.